everybody, alongside Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Welcome to EA Sports. Laval's in closer mode here as they go into tonight's game. You want to stay hungry. You know the other team's going to be desperate trying to stay alive. But you can end this right now. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. The quest for Lord Stanley's mug continues right here tonight, and we are underway. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Takes the feed. Manitoba's got it in their own zone. Here's a howitzer at the net. Denies him. He got all of it. Lots of time left in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Laval's got it in the defensive zone. From the right side, moves it up ahead. And we've got a two-on-one. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. The Moose have been called for tripping on the play. I always found this a frustrating penalty to take. There's really no aggression to it. You're trying to steal the puck, but you end up clipping the guy down. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. Whether there's been a lot of chances or very few chances, what generally breaks the ice is when somebody gets a power play. They get the man advantage, they become a little more aggressive. Laval's got the puck along the wall. Skates across the blue line. To his teammate. Couldn't complete the play. Puck grab by Dauphin. And that's a paddling from the goaltender. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. And another stop. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. On the attack along the boards. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Sends it over. Too many bodies in the way. Stop that one. Gets it out of his own end. Solid effort by the penalty-killing unit as the power play comes up empty. Well, they'll have to regroup after that. The power play doesn't cash in. Opportunity lost for them. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Moves the puck. Grabs it in his own end. Manitoba's moving it up the ice. Puck picked up in the open ice. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Maintains possession. Quick feed down low. Big time defensive play. Here they come on the attack. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Moose have gained possession off the wall. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. The Moose have the puck in the neutral zone. Pokes it away in his own end. The Rocket have it in their own zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Manages to hang on. Centered out in front. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. And he makes the save. The Moose have gained control of the puck along the wall. They go on the attack from the left side. Manitoba's got the puck against the boards. And that goes off a player in front. Trying to get back on the attack now. The Rocket have taken possession along the wall. Through center along the wing. The Moose have it on the attack. Laval's playing it through the neutral zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Oh, the puck doesn't get there. So crowded in front of the goaltender. White's got it along the boards. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Here's an odd man rush. Excellent stick work on the play. Denies him in front. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. Here he is, wrestled on net. He scores! <laughs> he 
He's probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. Manitoba's on the board first. What now? Attack. Don't sit back. You're not defending the lead with way too much time left. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. And now it's grabbed by Gustafson. Manitoba's got it along the wall. Big play inside the defensive zone. Manitoba's got a hold of the puck. And he handles the cross ice pass. And he's ridden off the puck. And now he angles it across to Dauphin. Oh, bold move by the goaltender as he pokes it away. Past the midway mark of the frame, we've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. The Moose have possession along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Wax into the offensive zone. Laval's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. And the play continues. And he denied that opportunity. Moves it quickly over to Dauphin. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Great stick work with the steal. Toss it up in the neutral zone. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. And the puck leaves the zone. Manitoba's looking to break out. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Couldn't complete the play. Gets a hold of the puck here at his own end. Passes it over to L.A. Not able to connect. Can't get it to go. Comrie's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. Laval still down here in the first despite the multiple scoring opportunities. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Green. He carries the puck up along the wing. Receives the pass and puts it wide in the cage. Man, it tells you how close it can be. If that's two inches to the other side, it's off the post and in. Battle along the boards. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. It's a two-on-one. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Sent into the offensive zone. Laval's got the puck behind the net. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Routine glove stopped by Primo. Here in the later stages of this period, 1-0 is where we sit at this point. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Puck battle along the boards. Manitoba's got a hold of it against the wall. The Rocket have the puck in the defensive zone. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. And they can't connect. Laval's got it along the wall. Puts it in deep. Manitoba's gained possession along the boards. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Nice pass. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Jabs the puck away. Scrum along the boards. Laval's got a hold of it along the wall. Into the corner. Manitoba's got it in their own zone. Over the line they come. Fires it into the offensive zone. Laval's got the puck along the boards. Denied that one. Smothered that in close chance. Gains the zone from the right side. Along the half wall with the puck. Sends it down low. Sends the pass over. Here he is in front. Oh, going wide. 
just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. The Rocket have gained possession off the wall. The Moose have control of the puck. Back to the blue line. Puts it on goal. That's blocked. Laval's got the puck in the defensive end. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Laval's got the puck against the half wall. Sends it across the ice. Manitoba's in transition. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. We got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. Laval's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. And that closes the book on the first 20 minutes of this one. Manitoba's pace of play, the difference here in the first 20 minutes, they lead it 1-0. Hey, like to join our insiders club here second tonight. period still to come we'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action press conferences practices or even the locker room tour membership is free so what are you waiting for join our insiders club today james sabalski ray ferraro bringing you all the action period number two is about to go Manitoba's penalty killers have their work cut out for them here. But a nice start to the period as they win the draw. Laval's got it against the boards. Takes control of the puck. Here he is from the slot. Scores! Putting the power in power play. They just about everything right on that man advantage. They capitalized. Play's job is to create shots and if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice you're going to be successful dead center in the slot he doesn't miss Laval's even things up here to start this second period nobody seems to be able to get the upper hand here I've been really impressed with how well played this has been Laval's takes the pass he tries to dangle and the puck skips away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Great defensive effort with the stick. Gains the zone on the left wing. Manitoba's got the puck in their own end. Laval's gained possession. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Laval's got the puck along the wall. Moves right to the middle. From the slot, wrist shot, stones up with the blocker. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Gets a hold of the puck, and he comes up with it. Picked up along the boards by Joe Fang. Laval's got the puck against the wall. And they can't convert to the play. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Takes the feed. Denied by the goaltender. Comrie's able to make the save, as we see here. This is a good scoring chance, but he's in good position. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Slides the puck over. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Sends a pass over. Puck set in, and that will allow for a fresh group of forwards to get out on the ice. Slides it across to Dauphin. 
Good hit on the play. The Moose have the puck against the boards. Dano's got it on the offensive end. And he regains control of the puck. Takes the feed. And that puck leaves the zone. Dano's got it in the defensive end. Scoops up the puck now. Strong use of the body. And that's stopped by Primo. The Rocket have gained control of the puck along the wall. Quick pass to L.A. Strong defensive effort. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Moves it to L.A. Way too much congestion blocks that. Nice poke check. Rips it on net. Oh, what a stop. The Moose have taken possession along the wall. Laval's got it now. Gives them nothing in front. Comrie's able to make the save on that slapper. Man, he walked right into it, but the goalie's equal to the task. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. It's all tied up. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Moves the puck along the half wall. And he takes a shot wide of the net. Stanley's lugging the puck. The Rocket have possession along the boards. Throws it on goal with the stop. Here's a short pass to White. No one home on that play. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Break away with the stop. The Rocket have the puck in their own zone. Manitoba's got a hold of it against the wall. Handles the puck. Grabs it in his own end. And he coughs it up with the pass. A chance in front. And that goes off the post and out. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. The centermen glide into position. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Steps into the offensive end. Manitoba's got it from behind the net. Snaps it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Yeah, it's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Manitoba's won the draw. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Stays with it. Hangs onto the puck. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Loose puck battle along the boards. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And look at that after the whistle here. Clearly trying to goad him into something. Yeah, or hurt him. That's a pretty good slash. Gustafson's not interested in dropping the mitts and going at it. Power play unit comes out for the faceoff. This is why you have meetings in the morning. You look at video of the penalty killers. You try to establish what their tendencies are going to be. Push the penalty killers into some place they're not comfortable. Dumps it in. Manitoba's gained possession along the boards. With possession along the wall. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Solid check to slow him down. Manitoba's got a hold of it along the wall. Laval's going to play the puck from behind the cage. And they manage to clear it. Manitoba's got the puck. Angles it over to Gustafson. Harkins plays the puck. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Cross the blue line and they'll get that much needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired. Now you can get a fresh group on the ice. Laval's penalty killers deserve a pat on the back as we are still tied. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. That knocks him off the puck. Battling for it along the boards. The Rocket have gained possession off the wall. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to L.A. 
And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. The Moose have taken possession along the wall. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. The Rocket have it in their own zone. Knocked away. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Receives the pass. Laval's got it across the line. Here's the chance to set up now. Keeps hold of the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. White stick handling in his own zone. Moves the puck. They fight for it along the boards. Laval's got the puck along the wall. Manitoba's got control of it now from their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Quick feed to Green. Nice pass. Here he is on the backhand. Answered the call there. Save made by the goalie. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. Past the midway mark of the frame. James and Ray with you tonight. We got a tie game. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Laval's moving it along the wing. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Takes the feed from his netminder. Can't find his man. Great heads-up play by the defender. Manitoba's got the puck along the boards. Sends the pass over. Makes a move in front. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Pretty good shot. The goalie's able to get the blocker up on it and put it outside. In the final moments of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Laval's across the blue line. Here he is in close. Not even close. He misses by a large margin. He's right in the middle of the ice. Takes the pass. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Slides it over with pace to Dauphin. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Manitoba's got a hold of it against the wall. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. Dano's off to the box. Two minutes for tripping. Played with fire. He got burned, Ray. Uh, he's digging around for the pocket. Sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down and he's got to go to the box. Another scoring opportunity looms here. Sometimes it's just your night and the way that they've performed on the power play. It kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Unloads a shot! And that's blocked away. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Well, that's taking it from his own end. Into the attacking area from the left side. Takes the feed. Turns it away. The setters will glide into the dot. Manitoba's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. And play is finally halted here. Let's see what the call is. The Moose having called for holding. Well, he got his money's worth there. That is a holding penalty. Laval salivating with a five-on-three power play. You can really change the course of a game here with a five-on-three power play. Score a couple of goals. It changes the complexion completely. Puck move back to the neutral zone. Laval's got it behind the net. Slides the puck over. Looking to make something happen in the offensive Whoa. zone. He scores! And a big one from there! That's a pretty critical goal in the playoffs here. It's his first ever.
The power play cashes in. They move the puck around and get the puck right into the middle of the slot. He makes no mistake from there. The Rocket have gone ahead by one late in the second period. They'd love to get this into the third period with the position they are now. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Look out! Oh, couldn't finish the job. What an excellent opportunity, Ray. They worked their way into good shape. He's just not able to beat the goalie. Sends a pass over. A chance on goal. Comes up with the stop. Laval's generated a lot of quality scoring chances, which is why they lead here late in the second. When the home team wins, you win $10 off at Rob's. When the home team wins, bring your tickets to any Rob's Sporting Goods for a coupon good for $10 off your next purchase of $50 or more. Tickets must be redeemed within a week of the game. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. Alongside Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabalski, ready to bring you period number three. Laval's man advantage is still intact as this period gets underway, and they win the draw. And the puck clears the zone. Tries to make that cross ice speed. Takes it and looks ahead. The Moose have gained possession under man. Both teams are now back to even strength as the power play has expired. Well, it's still looking bleak and up here. They've got to climb back into the game, but if their PK doesn't do the job there, they wouldn't have had any chance. From the neutral zone now. Laval's got the puck along the wall. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. The Moose have put themselves shorthanded, tripping the call. They're going to be down a man here. Once he gets his stick into the player's feet, it's almost inevitable a tripping penalty will result. Tough to argue that call. As they're about to drop the puck, the power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. Every once in a while, you get a full moon and a great power play. They're having it tonight. Everything is going their way. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Pokes it away in his own end. Gets in front of it. Let's it go. There's another stop. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Blocked in traffic. Denies him in close. Comrie's got the puck. Boy, he's been under fire tonight. Been really sharp, and in a close game, you can't make a mistake that costs a critical goal. Laval's turned good defense into good offense as they lead it early in this third period. Manitoba's got a hold of the puck and manages to clear the zone. Laval's got the puck behind the net. Takes the feed, moving in. Maintains possession. Takes the feed. Comrie's going to hang on just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's a 2-1 game. The man advantage is over. Well, somehow they worked their way through that last power play. The penalty killers get the job done. It's not been a very smooth night for them. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. He was locked in there. Handles the puck. 
Manitoba's in now. Gains the zone through the middle. Takes the puck at the point. Couldn't find the intended target. Receives the pass. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. He scores! You know he was nervous. The rookie gets into his first playoff. That first career playoff goal will help him relax. The good thing he one-times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. Manitoba's made this one a fun one for the stretch drive. All evened up in the third. It's never easy chasing the game. They've found a way to get the equalizer and now shorten the game right out. Nothing doing on that. Moves it quickly over to L.A. Made the stop on that play. Oh, he stops him with the glove. Great reflexes there. Oh, you can see the shooter. He looked straight up to the sky. He thought that was past the goalie, but the tender made enough of a save to keep the puck out of the net. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Stones him in front. Palmer's got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. And the play's whistled dead. Let's get the call. Holding is the call, something you probably would have got away with in, say, the 90s. Oh, you would have got away with a lot more than that in the 90s. Right now, the standard's way tighter. I like it better now. Manitoba's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. When you don't get many power plays, you really have to make them count. One goal could be a big difference maker. Stopped by the goaltender. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Denies him again! Primo's always so secure in his save selection. Nice stop, but the rebound in the corner is the best part. They get it out of the defensive end. Scooped up along the wall by Dauphin. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Huge steal in his own end. Puck battle along the boards. Across the line. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Manitoba's regained possession of the puck. Passes ahead from the right side. The Rocket have gained control of the puck shorthanded. And a successful clearing attempt. Quick pass to Gustafson. They go on the attack through center. Takes a shot. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Primo's got to get out, square up to the shot. And when that slapper comes, be quick enough to get in front of it. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Laval's got it in the defensive zone. Up along the wing. Across the line from center. Manitoba's on the attack. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Picks up the puck in his own end. Nice pass. Moves the puck. Excellent stick work on the play. Sends the pass over. Laval's got it in their own zone. And they fail to go tape to tape. Takes a shot, and that one's turned away. Back to the point it goes. The Rocket have gained control of the puck along the wall. On the attack along the boards. Here he is, shot right in front. Manitoba's got the puck in their own end. Oh, he'll feel that one. Gets the puck in deep. Grabs it in his own end. Laval's got a hold of the puck. 
The Moose have possession along the boards. And now he moves it to Bork. Handles it along the blue line. And that sails over the net. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Laval's looking to break out. Moves it to L.A. Strong defensive effort. Into the corner now. Manitoba's got the puck inside the defensive zone. They've got numbers. Big play inside the defensive zone. He's got a breakaway. Big save. I know you like goals, Ferraro, but that was impressive. Yeah, great. Good. Nice save, pal. <laughs> Manitoba's got it in their own zone. From center, they get into the attacking area. Here's a chance. Big save. And he came out and challenged them. Good save. Primo's made an excellent stop here. He follows the puck and shuts down the scoring chance. Past the halfway mark of this period, it's all tied up. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Laval's looking to break out. Scoops up the puck here. Laval's playing it through center. Dauphin's got it along the wing. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Battle along the boards. Takes control of the puck. Can't connect. And he loses control of the puck. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Manitoba's got it in their own zone. Uses the force on that hit. Puck exits the zone. Takes the pass. Laval's got the puck against the boards. Manages to hang on. Takes the feet at the back end. Moves it around along the half wall. And that pass goes awry. The Rocket have the puck against the boards. Strong defensive effort. Gustafson's picking up momentum through center. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Man, the teams have been going at each other since the very beginning of this hockey game. Nobody is back down. The body contact level has stayed extremely high. Here in the late going of the frame, we got a tie game. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Back at the point, they set it up. Moves it to Port. Manitoba's got it along the wall. Denies him in front. This is a face off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Manitoba's got it, and they're on the attack. And he can't find his man. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Laval's gained possession along the boards. Gets the puck back here in the neutral zone. The Rocket have it on the attack. And he puts that one aside with ease. Another stop by the goaltender. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Comrie's done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Gets a hold of the puck. Taken by Green. Takes the feed. Manitoba's got it in the offensive zone. He scores! His first career playoff goal! Different level of excitement, James. You score in the regular season, that's one thing. You get another one in the playoffs, and you are pumped. Geez, I like this, James. When the puck's in their hands, they attack, and they attack in layers. The odd man rush is worked to perfection. Manitoba's gone ahead here by one in the third. What's the message now for the stretch run, Ray? to be aggressive. Too often, teams sit back on their heels. They give up a chance. They give up a power play. Pretty soon, it's an all-out scramble. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Stops him with a glove! A 
A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Approaching the final 60 seconds of this one. Made the stop on the play. Trying to get back on the attack now. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Laval's on the attack. This one gives them nothing in front. Comrie's play has been outstanding tonight. From the time the puck hit the ice, he's been locked in. Great save percentage, and he's a reason they're close in this game. Laval's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides the puck over. The Moose have it in their own zone. Manitoba's moving it up the ice. Wide open net. Misses. Laval's got the puck in the defensive end. The Moose have taken possession along the wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. He scores! And a big one at that! Oh, the rookie comes through in his first playoff year with his first playoff goal. Well, now you got a couple of goal lead here with the empty netter. That should be enough to put this away. The Moose have pretty much sealed the deal after that empty netter. Always a good feeling on the bench when you get that empty netter. It gives you the cushion to realize this one's probably over. Accomplished. They're moving on. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Drills them. And there's the final horn bringing this one officially to an end. And with that win, they push them to the brink of elimination. This is such a critical game in a series. So pivotal. You get up three games to two. Now you got a couple of cracks to put this away. And you know your opponents are going to be feeling the pressure now. Love the sportsmanship. Love the respect. But it can't be easy at one end. No, it's really a great tradition that has grown in the sport. But when you're going through that and realize that your season is over, you are flat. You're out of air. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray. I'm James. Good night.